And this comes from Tim Adams at Chef Timmy 29. If you had to choose right so now, a lot of tags. Who will have the brighter future, <laughs> Caleb Williams or Connor Bedard? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Man, if so, if Caleb Williams, Can they both be equally awesome. That if, would be great. If Caleb Seriously. Williams becomes what a lot of people think he can be, reason he became the number one overall pick, um, he, I think he's going to have the brighter future because of the popularity yeah. of the Bears and what success. Sure as a Chicago Bears quarterback in Chicago would mean. Now, if Connor Bedard leads the Blackhawks to multiple Stanley Cups and is the f- next face of the NHL, that, that I think that might surpass being a very good Bears quarterback. I would think one Super Bowl as a star Bears quarterback your immortal is forever. way more important to this city than five Stanley Cups in a row. Yes, it could be. Yeah, uh, right. I think. I most, mean, there there are yeah. punters on the eighty-five Bears that haven't bought a freaking meal. In this <laughs> Let's go, Maury Buford. Maury Buford, baby, his, in his used car lot. Like, good on the um, right. As far as like, who's got the better path to succeed? I mean, right now, you have to say Caleb because Caleb has a far better supporting cast than Connor Bedard does. Yes, uh, right well, now, right and now, that, walking in is a weird. One, yeah. yeah, football is a weird. Sport where you have huge rollover each season, like a lot of uh, you know, roster a lot of roster fluctuation. Um, I mean, it's it's apples and oranges when you're trying to compare the two sports. But I mean, as far as being like a star in this town and this world, it's Caleb Williams has yeah. the chance to be. A much bigger star. I'm gonna I'm gonna separate like what it would mean for the Bears in the city and what how important the Hawks are in the scope of Chicago and just say as an individual player, who is going to be if you just remo- like let's just say a fantasy draft or whatever, right? You just remove them and just say they're both free agents, who is a bigger, more important player? I'm gonna give that edge to Bedard. I, I'm I don't know. Maybe it's just years of disappointment and Bears quarterbacks, and Cause just because we, we've never known what it's like we don't to have know. an elite I, quarterback. And it's so much harder to be a great franchise-altering quarterback than it is to be a franchise-altering center or forward or defenseman in hockey. Like if Connor Bedard is a consistent 100-point scoring player, which is what all the expectations are for him. Mm-hmm. He's going to be a Hall of Famer. He's probably going to win at least the Stanley Cup or get very, very close to it. Like Caleb Williams needs a lot to go right to be that good and that consistent. I hope it happens. I, w- I want him to be great, maybe more than I've ever wanted anything in this town. I'm not even kidding. Yeah. Like every time Caleb Williams drops back, I'm just like, please, 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 please do something awesome. Please do something awesome. I've never felt that way about a Chicago athlete before because there's so much hope tied to it yeah. that you look at the rest of the team like, okay, if he's good, we are talking. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We all silly like the mayor. 